it's a uh, multi Eco 7 and today I'm going to be showing you a few tips on how to keep your goalie glove in good shape um, and how to get the flex good and how to keep it open as you can see my can't open very well right now because I left it out in my bag and my mom opened the bag up and it dried out so this is what my um, glove normally is right now it sucks but normally it's like this wait normally it's like this but it's like this now so the flex is all right now wait dang it flex is all right um it used to it, it normally is better when uh it used to have, like flex like a baseball glove, like. But uh, same deal. Got dried out. Can't close that well. So I'm gonna be showing you a few t few tips to get your glove open, and a few tips to get your glove um, close better. Okay. So the first tip is when you're playing, if you feel like your glove is really small looking. Try going like this and bend it on your thigh. So that should work. Just hold it there for a second, a while, and then eventually it'll fold into your thigh shape, and it'll be big. See? Um. Another way to do it is to so bring the spine here. Bring the spine end on the back like the webbing and fold it into the other side so you see what that does like this and keep it there for a while it will not pop back out unless you force it to so that's a really good way that's what I normally do and you can push it in as far you can step on it you can bring this part up and then step into it, that'll normally work. So, and then see how laid back it is on the other edge? Look at it, you can see, like it's a hole. Anyway, so yeah, and then, okay, do not do it in this time, but by then, uh, this sh you should keep it like this for about two hours, but Instead, and then when you're done, just go like this. Just pop it back out, and now it's huge. See? So, <clears throat> it'll get bigger if, uh, with most I've seen, it will get bigger if you keep it in there for a couple hours. With mine, it barely got any bigger. But, uh, and then here's some good flex tips. If your glove is, isn't flexing well and it's just going like this, sort of, Try to, well, here's a, the best tip I can think of. It's what I use. Uh, so get a softball and put it in the web and then close, squeeze it as much as you can. By then it'll probably be like this. And then um, let's say you wrap it around with like, let's see, not a rubber band. It should be something thick, like a old dog leash or something, just wrap it around here and then stuff it under your mattress um, and that should work um, once again uh, if you don't have a goalie glove then this video is pointless for you so leave and uh, if you're looking to get a goalie glove and you haven't left yet like I told you to then uh, well this goalie glove this is a junior and this was about four hundred fifty dollars so if you're a senior, then probably be like 545 or something. But uh, yeah, so. And uh, here's another good flex tip. Just grab this. Okay, so grab this and then close it and then bend. All right, so you see how you have this good flex and then go like this. Bend this back and forth. It doesn't really tell you, it doesn't really seem like it would help a lot, but 
it does because look how straight it is before it was like this so and then look how straight it is that gives you a better ability to close it look how thin that is so see now that I've done that look at see so if you don't own a goalie glove then you should get one if uh, my local store, well actually I don't get them locally, I get them in, well I live in, I live in Flagstaff, Arizona, and uh, I live in Flagstaff, Arizona, and I get all my equipment from Phoenix, Arizona, at this place called Behind the Mask. If you live in the Arizona area and you've never heard of this place, look it up, Behind the Mask, Arizona, hockey. Thanks. Bye.